Huawei ditches, UK deal, Huawei and the UK. It was supposed to be a match made in tech heaven, a multi-billion dollar deal to bring superfast 5G to Britain. Everyone was excited. Then, bam, Huawei pulled out. What happened? Why did Huawei walk away from such a massive opportunity? This wasn't just about money. It was about global dominance in the world of technology. And it looks like things just got very interesting. Buckle up, because we're diving deep into the messy breakup of Huawei and the UK. The $8.3 billion handshake. What was on the table? This was not just any ordinary business deal. It was a monumental agreement that had the potential to reshape the technological landscape of an entire nation. Imagine a world where your internet is so fast it makes your head spin. That's what 5G promises. It's not just about faster download speeds, it's about revolutionizing how we live, work and play. From smart cities to autonomous vehicles, 5G is the backbone of the future. And the UK wanted in. Badly. The government and businesses alike saw the immense potential and were eager to be at the forefront of this technological revolution. They knew that being a leader in 5G could boost the economy and improve the quality of life for millions. They turned to Huawei, a Chinese tech giant, to make it happen. The deal was huge. Huawei had the expertise, the technology and the resources to build a state-of-the-art 5G network. It seemed like the perfect partnership, we're talking $8.3 billion huge. This was not just a financial investment, it was a strategic move that could position the UK as a global leader in technology. Huawei would build a big chunk of the UK. Are you enjoying the video? If yes, please subscribe, like and share our videos for more updated and exciting content. Let's continue. UK's 5G network. This involved installing thousands of 5G towers, upgrading existing infrastructure and ensuring seamless connectivity across the country. It was a win-win, right? The UK would get cutting-edge technology and Huawei would gain a significant foothold in a major market. Both sides stood to benefit immensely from this collaboration. The UK gets lightning-fast internet. Imagine streaming your favourite shows without any buffering downloading large files in seconds and enjoying seamless video calls. The possibilities were endless. Huawei gets a foothold in a major market. This was a golden opportunity for Huawei to expand its influence and showcase its technological prowess on a global stage. But some people were worried. Not everyone was convinced that this deal was a good idea. There were concerns about the implications of allowing a foreign company to control such a critical part of the nation's infrastructure. They feared that Huawei's close ties to the Chinese government posed a security risk. Could sensitive information be accessed or manipulated? Could the network be used for espionage? Could China spy on the UK through Huawei's technology? This was a question that loomed large and could not be ignored. The potential risks were significant and needed to be carefully considered. This question loomed large over the deal. It cast a shadow over what could have been a groundbreaking partnership, leaving many to wonder if the benefits outweighed the risks. Huawei's side of the story. Why the walkout? This question has been on everyone's mind since the tech giant made its unexpected move. Huawei says they pulled out because of political factors. The company has been under immense scrutiny and pressure from various governments around the world. The UK government, under pressure from the US, was making it harder and harder for Huawei to do business there. This pressure was not just a recent development, but had been building up over several years. The US government had been warning its allies about Huawei for years. They raised concerns about the potential risks associated with using Huawei's technology in critical infrastructure. They claimed that Huawei's equipment could be used for espionage by the Chinese government. These allegations were based on fears that the Chinese government could exploit Huawei's technology to gather intelligence. The UK, caught in the middle of a tech war between superpowers, felt the heat. The decision to involve Huawei in their 5G network became a contentious issue with significant political and economic implications. 
Huawei always denied these allegations. They consistently maintained that their operations were independent and that their technology was safe. Huawei emphasized their commitment to transparency and security, offering to work with governments to address any concerns. But the damage was done. The continuous allegations and political pressure had already taken a toll on Huawei's reputation and business prospects. The UK started to back away from the deal. The government began to reconsider its position, influenced by the mounting pressure and the potential risks highlighted by their allies. Huawei, facing a future of restrictions and suspicion, decided to cut their losses. The company chose to withdraw from the UK market, focusing instead on regions where they faced fewer obstacles and could operate more freely. Britain in the balance, navigating the fallout. So, what now for the UK? They're scrambling to find a replacement for Huawei. But it's not that easy. Huawei's technology is advanced and affordable. Finding another company that can fill their shoes won't be cheap or quick. The UK is now staring down a potential digital divide. They risk falling behind in the race for 5G. This could hurt their economy and their global standing in the tech world. The UK is caught between a rock and a hard place. They want fast, reliable 5G. But they also want to keep their country safe. Balancing these competing priorities is proving to be a major headache. A global tech cold war, the bigger picture. The Huawei saga is about more than just one deal. It's a symptom of a larger trend, the growing rivalry between the US and China, particularly in the realm of technology. The US is worried about China's growing tech prowess. They see Huawei as a symbol of China's ambitions to become a global leader in 5G and beyond. This has sparked a tech cold war, with countries forced to choose sides. This tech rivalry has huge implications for the future. It will shape everything from the internet we use to the weapons that countries develop. The stakes are incredibly high. Despite the setback of pulling out from the $8.3 billion UK deal, Huawei has continued to thrive in other markets. Their innovative technology and strategic partnerships have led to significant growth and success globally. This chapter will delve into the key achievements and milestones Huawei has reached since the deal's collapse. From pioneering advancements in 5G technology to expanding their presence in Asia, Africa and Latin America, Huawei's resilience in the face of adversity is nothing short of remarkable. Their strategic alliances with local telecom companies have bolstered their market presence, making them a formidable player on the global stage. Moreover, Huawei's commitment to research and development has resulted in cutting-edge products that are shaping the future of connectivity. Their investment in AI, cloud computing and smart devices continues to push the boundaries of what's possible. So, while the UK deal might have been a significant blow, Huawei's story is far from over. Their ability to adapt, innovate and grow in other markets underscores their position as a leading tech giant in the global arena. Stay tuned as we continue to follow Huawei's journey and the ever-evolving landscape of global technology. Subscribe to Revo now and join our vibrant community of forward thinkers, changemakers and revolutionaries.